Hey, you guys, it's Sunshine Vibes with the High Vibrations. If you are new to my channel, thank you for watching. If you are returning, thank you for supporting your girl. Love and light to you all. I hope I'm not loud, like too loud. But anyway, I just got finished doing some yoga, you guys. I'm fasting right now, so I'm drinking my tea. So a lot of you could be in the mood of like procrastination. I mean, maybe not even procrastination, just feeling like depleted of your energy. It's important to stay up, prayed up, meditation, okay, and prayer, visualizations, okay, somebody might need to do some yoga, or go for a walk or something here, okay, somebody's projecting some negative energy around you, okay, somebody might even need to talk to somebody here, okay, but it's important to stay prayed up, ooh, okay, let me... Somebody might need to hear something out of my little book. So, Spirit is guiding me to read out of my worry less, pray more book. So, I'm going to see. Somebody might need to hear this. Okay. I opened the page to qualified by God. By ourselves, we are not qualified in any way to claim that we can do anything. Okay. God makes us qualified. The world would have. The world would have you believe that to be successful, you must have a high degree of self-sufficiency, counting on yourself alone to provide your needs, yet such an attitude will lead you away from God. Your true and loving provider, the God who wants you to live in him as he lives in you, to be dependent on him so he can work through you to his glory. An attitude of self-sufficiency also leads you to worrying about how you will meet all your needs and, ke and keeps you from praying to the one who provides them. So the next time worry comes creeping along, look within to see if you're hoarding an attitude of self-sufficiency. Ask God to root it out so you can become the woman or man he created you to be. One dependent on him alone. Keep me leaning on and relying on you, Lord, for I know I can do I can do nothing without you. Okay, so worry less, pray more, you guys. Okay, it is important to stay grounded right now. Okay, so don't worry about uh chasing that bag. Okay, chase God. Okay, he's gonna he gonna fill that bag up. Okay, not saying don't go to work. I don't don't apply pressure, but. Remain humble, okay? It's about just remaining humble, keeping God first. Because without him, we can't... Who are we? We are nobody. So, it's important to talk to God, okay? About whatever it is that you're worrying about. Okay, so give me some clear messages for my collective. Clear messages. Okay, I okay. got healthy relationships. And healing. Okay, so a lot of you all could be getting in, um, trying to get yourself in a new environment of being around healthy relationships. This doesn't have to be a, um, a connection. This could be family, friends, okay? I feel like you are healing. Yeah, humble beginnings, energy. Something about the energy here is going to change for you. Yeah, because you've been doing it alone. But you are not doing it alone because God is with you, okay? So do not think about, do not think about, uh, do not worry about things that you cannot control her, okay? I feel like you will be successful in life as long as you keep God first and remain humble with her, okay? Yeah, what I say? Something about the energy, you guys. Something about the energy is, uh... I feel like the vibration is rising for you all, okay? Some of y'all could have been in a negative energy. Yeah, because it's time to move on her. Candles, okay? Candles are very healing. So, something about the energy. You are healing others. All right, it's time to get into a higher vibration here and bring some balance to your life. Okay, yeah, poor. So, I'm getting somebody just... Spirit, okay, it needs to be uplifted. It is time to be around people that lift up your spirit, okay? It is so easy to, yeah, be around your soul tribe, okay? Past relationship issues. So you could have had a lot of past relationship issues and you're trying to get into a more healthy state of mind here, okay? And you're trying to, 
okay, erase the vibration and the energy, okay? So you can move on with her and bring balance to your life, okay? Yeah, two, two, two. What I say, laziness. So a lot of you guys be, could be feeling this energy of being lazy, okay? But two, 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 it's a new beginning, her humble beginnings. I'm her, yeah, new love. Yeah, because somebody change, has a change mindset of her. So you could have been all okay with being in karmic relationships. And now it's just time to level up. I cannot make this up. So to level up with somebody new, okay, to get in the energy of actually healing yourself, okay, yeah, okay, so a witch, so you could, could have been dealing with somebody, yeah, demons, who was a witch, okay, uh, constantly putting demons on you, attacking you, yeah, family, it could have been a family member or, um, a lover, her, trying to attack you. But Spirit is saying it's time to move on and level up and get into a new energy here. You could be saying 2 2 2 a lot, but this is a new beginning. Yeah, because you one step closer to victory. Dreadful disappointment. You could be really disappointed about this, about finding out whatever you found out. Okay, but it is time to move on and level up. Yeah, sexy. Okay. I feel like you got somebody here that you are looking looking at. Somebody new or somebody new is looking at you. Like, okay. Yeah, because when in doubt. When in doubt, stop doubting and believe, I'm her. Stop doubting and believe. Yeah, some some type of mental attention her and guidance. So um meditation is going to help you with this with this guidance, okay? And doing yoga is really just um uh, actually getting the energy flowing through your body. So you might want to try some yoga, looking up some yoga, but I feel like you have a passionate new beginner here with somebody who you are looking at as like everything okay yeah abundance but i feel like it's something to do with abundance her you and this person when it's humble beginning something to do with these candles okay you y'all healing each other something about abundance and it's gonna attract a lot of abundance okay yeah cleanse your energy okay if you need a sage yes yeah, seven chakra something about the balancing okay balancing these mixed emotions stay 10 toes down okay because something is coming in yeah write down your goals pray put the work in and behind watch your dreams unfold so somebody's dreams is about to come true here because somebody is changing their mind and actually trying to change something here confirmation yeah love and soul contract okay somebody's in love and they have a soul contract here Okay. Yeah. Somebody was dealing with it. She it's karmic could have been doing spells. Okay. Cheating lies. Somebody had enough. A karmic. Okay. Call me. They want you to call them. Or this is you. Or this karmic wants to somebody had enough and somebody's moving on. Somebody's going to a more healthier uh situation. Her somebody's tired of lying and cheating. Yeah, strength. I keep him codependent so I can control him. Okay, so what I was just reading. He did say, okay, gives all your burdens to him so you won't be codependent, okay, twin flame. Because you can meet somebody, okay, with this new love. I'm going to get in the new love or this, yeah, okay, you're an empath. Something to do with your cousin, sir. But I really am getting this energy of somebody just leaving something, some type of karmic situation behind, going towards something more healthier and more... They something they are more passionate about. Yeah, somebody that brings you peace. Okay, that's a star out here. Okay. And something to do with your karmic uh cousins. Okay, what else? Yeah, Queen of Cups. I feel like this person is very nurturing, caring, loving, yeah, and passionate, just as passionate about you. Something about the seven chakras, okay? Okay, something about somebody's cousins getting jail time here. I don't know why I just heard that. Okay, grounded. What I say, it's important to stay grounded right now. Okay? And then I got guidance. So you are receiving this guidance. Okay? I feel like you've been meditating her. Yeah, keep it simple. Okay? You've been meditating her. And you know that somebody is trying to keep you codependent so they can control you. So you walking away from this um, karmic, karmic energy. Yeah, because hot drama, it shit's no good, okay? Spirit said it's no good. Somebody's burdened by guilt. They feel really guilty for what they did, having mixed emotions. 
okay because you've been focused okay and somebody the chariot in reverse somebody does not know how to maintain independence in a relationship her okay spirit is saying continue to show gratitude 10 10 as i said that so this cycle is completed her continue to show gratitude and be thankful because somebody's stuck and they want to